21st century environment force have done our clean up here in the town with the uh, local newspaper but let's have a show you what it's like on actually inside the town itself because it's not bad at all in fact it's very good so this is what I'm saying we need to be doing a little bit more which we can be done but uh, it's I would say very nice if you go further in it gets even better as you go further so we'll show you bits of it so you see the other side of it but like I say, you can see the good things and everything, but you've got to start seeing the other things, because they're the ones that are going to kill you. There's a dead there, but someone's even put a bottle of water there. Right now, if you realise how precious water is, you go to people in South Africa and ask them, or people in India that haven't got any water, how precious water is. You just can't put it in bottles and leave it around. Coming a bit closer to the centre. So it's a lovely park over there. Okay. Now, what first thing that strikes you is that you get these flowers on the lamppost. Doesn't take a lot, but it just makes a lot of difference, trust me. And uh, the cope over there has got lots of trees and everything else around it. People give me waves, hello. And uh, so. So that's, you know, it really does make a difference, okay? Clean pavements, clean roads. It's okay, you know? Nice day, white clouds. A can there. Four G's of water. Further into the town now. saying it's a good bicycle way. You're still on the road and you've got a white line that separates you from the traffic. And that's what I call it. I don't get up and down on bloody pavements and everything else and all the rest of it. Oh, so, yeah. A bit of a park here. Let's so we'll go further in. Flora, no harm with that. Now I did see a little bit from that. Which one it is, but it's got all these solar panels on. Yep, it's this one back here. Yeah, you know, just see the one there. Yeah, so that's good. Okay. Someone thinks I'm putting a camera at you. I'm solar panels. Sorry to disappoint you. See, if you put flowers upon the window box up there, it makes a huge difference to the area. Simple thing. One thing you can do. Okay, as you see now we're coming to the centre of town, all flowers around and pots and things. There is a nice church here, so I want to go a bit further off so I can show you from the distance what it looks like. Otherwise, in the east you can't really see it. I don't think it's a tourist town as such, I better find out, but I don't think it is, it's just an average Hungarian little town. But I'll find out if there's anything special about it. Just, 
don't know if you forgive me getting older, but wouldn't you rather have flowers around in your village where you're living rather than somebody going around picking up all your rubbish all the time? Yeah. Ooh, they're doing that, making it look better for you. Absolutely. Now, I'm going to say something a bit later on. So we're going to see what it's centre. I'm going to go to the park later on. There's a lake in it to see how it's been looked after. Okay, it's more the central square. I'm sure anybody who lives here is watching the video might be able to tell you something a bit more about it than I can. So it's not really a sightseeing tour, we're on a world environmental tour, so. We'll give you an idea of what places look like a little bit. Well, maybe you've never been to Hungary, I mean, it's the first time for me. Oh, ice cream, maybe I'll do a challenge on ice cream again, maybe stars. Do you have any mint ones? Sadly, again, there's no mint. Never mind. So I'm afraid no ice cream this time. There's no mint. I've got to find a try and find a chocolate mint. A nice one in Slovakia, but don't, they, were, they were quite rare there as well, actually. So I don't think the Hungarians and Slovakians are really into mint. Shame. Right. Anyway, we'll just quit round here. And then uh, I'll stop this video. And then we'll. Uh, Come back later on the long, so we're going up to the lake, but it's like I said, the park. I'm not sure where the German flags fly, but there's a reason for it, I guess. I'm sure somebody might tell me. Hey, look, there you are, the old fashioned drinking fountains that they're trying to bring back in and saying it's new. It's been around for a long time. I'm not too sure what that's all about. Now yeah, look, it's what I was trying to show you, that church up there, that's quite a nice photo, wouldn't you say? Just slow down a bit so you can actually see it, so it's so shaky. It's a nice view now. I've got that then. Right, now we're getting quite a few beeps. 